Hey guys, it's Ravensleaf45 and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV and Walker. We're in the early access and I did a little um fiddling around with my job system um job system, my loadout because a lot of stuff was changed from Shadowburner to Endwalker. Maybe a couple skills got removed and some well majority of the skills got removed for Summoner in particular because they removed all the dots. So I was like, eh. I can't use dots anymore on my summoner, so that is all right, I guess. Though we got the trade-off of using actual primal summons, so that's nice. But that'll be another video in a nutshell because I'll probably be going in detail what else got removed in the game. But for now, we're here in Alda, and we're going to be unlocking the new Reaper job class. Though I am very unfamiliar on all the skills pertaining to the Reaper, so this is going to be something I will need to learn on hand. So, to unlock Reaper, I said it earlier, you go to Alda, and you go exactly over here, near to the central Talonan gate. And it's not hard to miss, if you have the blue icon, it's, it's kind of not hard to miss. So, let's talk to this guy over here, the Flustered Attendant. Killer Instinct, and of course we get Soul Stone for the Reaper. And of course, a armor um, armor coffer for the starting gear, and a gold war sight. You there! You're the frying sword. Yes. And by the looks of it, one of no mean skill. My employee is in the desperate need of a woman of your talents. You see, he's been beset by threats of a unsavory group of thugs known as the Limeriers. Nemus, that's another word I don't know about. The leader demands my master part with some of his considerable wealth. Or well, I just tell you call her the Reaper. And leaves the rest of your imagination. We don't attend to or camerize this curious demands without fight. And stout arms by our side will go far to ensure our survival. Your arm, perhaps. In case the opportunity to perform a good deed is a incitement, though, please be reminded that my master possess considerable wealth. If you would aid us, come to the haste to the Sapphire Avenue Exchange. We are make our stand against these brutes. Uh, okay. Oh, are you like new jingle for Endwalker now? Okay, so Sapphire Exchange, here we come. I'm a little surprised I didn't see a lot of people hover around the NPC there getting trying to get the Reaper. I'm pretty sure a lot majority of them went to the Sage. Since we didn't have like a, a healer for a very long while. Yeah. Ah, you! I know who you are, and if you mean to lay a finger on my coin purse, you're deprived of my gold, lifeless. Master Jiro, she's a friend! This adventure has agreed to help! Who we'll show the Reaper what her empty intimidations are worth? You say now? Ah, oh, yes, my apologies, madame. Tensions had been high of late, as I am sure you can understand. For reasons to elude me, these Lemurs had made my life a walking nightmare. <sighs> Unseen, they demand I begin paying them for the luxury of my own life. Rumors abound with their origins. Some say they are Dietrichs of some barbaric nation. They fraught our laws and threaten their betters with impurity. They led by a dead lady killer who draws her sight at the slightest sight, refused their payment of coin, and she take her share of your lively blood instead. Rubbish, I say. The Reaper is not but a toothless bandit. You say that now, but... Interesting. Dare you out there. Care to test it? Eh. 
Hello, Mr. Reaper. You, you, you're the Reaper. Ah, oh, yes, you're a presenting one, aren't you? Suppose that's how you came to be in possession of so many shiny things. And what do we have here? Hmm, more help with your ledger remaining unbalanced? You wouldn't be trying to wiggle your way out of your paying for a job well done, would you? Oh, so he he asked them to do a job for him, but he refuses to pay. Now they're here to collect that debt that he owes them. Maybe you should have taken them up. Maybe you should hide them in the first place if you can't pay them. What's all about this sight unseen? You hired these neurons before? My, my. How do you keep the lie straight? You didn't tell you hired Muscle here what great friends we were. So great, in fact, that you trusted none other than me in mind to put the scare into your competition. A job we are happy to do. You can't find your fortune in this city without stepping over a few bodies along the way, after all. But, as flexible as our Muro are, I'm afraid we ought to coin to bend them. We only have one resources. Unless... Yeah, you wanna take it all on me then? Good luck with that pile. <laughs> Hmm. One does wonder how you forget yourself with a bodyguard of such uncommon metal. Uncommon metal? You never heard of my exploits? Boy, you're gonna get your shit rockin'. Aye. Not a ooze of fear in that gaze. And not a moat of puff of arrogance either. This last, my dear Jiro, is a genuine art. She has what is in the Mercedes trade called a killer instinct. Beg your pardon? Well, I do kill all our monsters and whatnot and Jarlin soldiers. How's this? For the sake of your long standing friendship, I'll make it simple. Allow me to take this adventure off your hands, and the debt is forgiven. Well, that's all? I believe this is what they in your trade called a bargain. As for you, adventure, it would seem you've been made a free agent. But if you are still inclined to put those instincts of yours to use, come visit our headquarters in the Pearl Lane. The door is open. I'll see ya. Well then, looks like my employer has been shifted to somewhere else. So, so I'm been shifted elsewhere. <laughs> all right, so we can just go all the way down here. Okay, loyal leader, show me in. The boss told me you belong. Come on in. Go side. Nice digs you got here. Boss, the guest of honor arrives. Ah, the savior Alamillo and Doma decide to appear before me. I, I hear all about you. It's hard not to in this line of work. The stories paint you of a frostly incarnate, a force of nature few have survived. 
peace, friend. I have no desire to put the killer to the proof, personally. I don't have a death wish. You can call me Dersulia. I'm a Reaper, one of many, and the leader of this little family here. As to why I bind you to our home is... There's a job I'd like you to take care of for me. Mm, and there's the rub. Depends on the job. A work. I won't work with criminals and thieves. Now, now, there's no need for name calling. I wish to your small clothes and listen to the particulars first. I won't ask you to do anything unsavory. This job will be a boon to your fellow man, in fact. Okay. All you have to do is kill one for me. Though perhaps kill isn't the right word, seems as he's already dead. Wait, if he's already dead, then why bother? <laughs> okay, so maybe it's like some person is pretending to be dead, but he's not actually dead? It's like, beg your pardon? Don't look so surprised. I know you've seen the dead walk. This time, you'll be up against a void set. Come here to unleash a singular brand of wickedness upon the world. It won't be an easy task. The evil driven this monster is black as the void and near as deep. Countless souls has succumbed to its hunger. Were you pray for what inclined to your heroics, don't you think? You can't face it as you are, though stories of as your strength may be. I need to train you in techniques. Techniques that will let you pierce the void and slaughter its king. Kin. What could you have teach me? Keep talking. What could you have teach me? The ways of the reaper. Wait, you're a garland? Don't see many garlands in Ola, do you? Let alone one as savage as this. Save your star gasp. I'm not out of surprises yet. And the job still. Hold your hand out of the crystal here. If you're made of the stuff I think you are, then you are in for a treat. Okay. Oh, hi, Mr. Void Scent. That's it! I knew you had what it takes. This be an avatar, a manifestation of your essence, and the spriggan power of the Void Scent on the other side. A Void Scent to which, if you choose you, will be binded to yourself. Okay. You gain skills unlike anything you have ever known. Skills that allow people like me to operate in the shadows and kill those that need killing since time immemorial. And your first assignment, should be walking this path, is to use the power of the voice against another for the betterment of the realm. Your reward will be wisdom of countless generations of Garland assassins. Who would think that um, the guild person that's going to be addressing me the job so is a Garland? But sit. Well, then again, it makes sense. And if you have a concern of your sanity and your soul, take your virtues. However, if you're not on this affordation objections and you don't mind walking the knife's edge to its life and death, then you have the tools to see your justice done and done right every time. I just want to point this out that it makes sense now that you know 
Xenos is a Reaper picking Garland, so having a Garland Reaper as a master makes perfect sense on why Xenos became a Reaper in the first place. This is the choice you must take, and soon. Every moment our quarry stalks the land is another opportunity for it to be do harm. Ooh, at this jazz. It's not something like the golden saucer though. I do dig it. I wish I can stay here all the time. <laughs> I think you come to your decision. Decision, am I right? There will be no turning away once you have chosen, mind you. You dance with death and return as its envoy, or you won't be returning at all. So, what will it be? I will not stop this voice sent to be checked in the instant. I will dance. I will not. I'm not much as a dancer, but I want the power to see my justice done. I prefer to keep well clear of death, if that's all the same to you. Hmm. I will not suffer this voice sin to threaten the innocent. I prefer to keep well clear of death, if it's all the same to you. I'll go with the first one. I will not suffer this voice sin to threaten the innocent. I will dance. Very good! Then let's not waste time. Take up this crystal and attach to both words that you walked as a reaper. Bind yourself to the void and climb the strength that the weak of the hearts shone. Though the avatar at your side does the void scenting bring its power to bear, feeding upon the souls of the field you cut down in return. Not a bad arrangement, eh? But I'm sure you tire of words. Here, the traditional weapon of her order. Let's see how it looks strapped to your back. Thank you. And I got my job stone. Oh, I love that jingle. I still really miss Childbringers though. Reaper unlocked. Okay. 